Um, hopefully you can see me and hear me. I'm just using my phone, so I mean, I, I can't have that many, much more technical issues. So anyway, um, yeah, uh, here we are, we're live. And um, if you've been here before, welcome back. And if you haven't been, I'm Angie Mason from Angie Mason Fluid Art. And uh, I'm glad you're here. So I have a couple things um, I need to go over. Um, I don't have the information yet though. Denise, um, can you type the info that I'm going? I didn't get anything yet about what I'm going to talk about. Anyway, I, I know I'm being cryptic, sorry. Um, so um, I wanna do this at the beginning. I always end up doing it at the end and you know, then nobody sees it. So. Um, Everybody in the chat, if you have a channel, please put in the chat that you have a channel. Um, hi, Donna. How are you, my love? I hope things are okay, and I've been sending you lots of love and light, and I'm really sorry for your loss, but I'm so glad you're here. And I'll do my best to make you laugh tonight, I promise. Auntie Gail, how are you? Big old doggy kisses um, from Trudy. She's in there sleeping. <laughs> and um, big hugs for me. Yeah. Um, acrylic art by Mary Kirk. Yay. Hello, darling. This was her debut night as our, as our brand new engine to our Monday night locomotive. We love Mary. She's so talented. Um, if you missed Mary, um, she started at 6, and that's going to be the start time of this train from now on. Um, <laughs> Nathan, uh, yeah, I have a chance. <laughs> You're silly. But Nathan Linzel from the Fine Art of Discretion is... <laughs> Fuck. I'm so sorry. Excuse me. I said fudge, and I apologize. Um, <laughs> from the fine art of distraction, he <laughs> he is my brother from another mother, and you need to check out his channel because, like, he is seriously talented. We want to get him up to a thousand before the end of the year. So let's let's do that. Let's all go over and sub to him, please. All right, um, okay, uh, I know all of you probably know I fried my hard drive. I didn't, someone else did, but uh, my hard drive is fried in my PC. So I'm streaming again from my phone, so bare bones, okay? Um, so the chat sometimes comes up on the screen and I'm half blind, so <laughs> I'm trying to um, see all of the uh, um, sorry, um, <laughs> all the comments that are coming in and, and people that are in here. Okay. My God, I'm getting so distracted. I don't know what's going on here. Um, okay. Um, I'm sorry. I've got a brain fart and I'm I'm trying to act like I don't, but I do, so uh it'll it'll come to me here in a second. Um let me sorry. <laughs> I was buffering, I know. I'm I'm sorry. It was because um it was because um I had to go into another another screen. Okay, before I forget, because I had to try and memorize everything in there, I want to announce that Julie E, Acrylic Painting with Julie E, and Nate Bright Art are doing a collaboration, um, um, a collaboration tomorrow night, and Nate is first at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. And then Julie is going to go <clears throat> at 8.30 Eastern Time. And 
um, they are using, I believe the, the, the primary color, you know, that they're both using is magenta. Julie E, um, if you could, uh, type in the chat, maybe a little more details for that because my memory is not good and I tried to memorize everything that you wrote. <laughs> but, um, yeah, tomorrow night, um, make sure to watch Nate Bright Art at 8 o'clock Eastern Time. And uh, Julie E. will be after him. It's going to be a collaboration between the two um, with the primary focus on the color magenta. So I'm kind of excited about this. And uh, then Julie will be going at 8.30. Um, and she will be in the chat to tell us more about that. But um, please try and be there because that's going to be an awesome collaboration. Nate Bright Art is brilliant, as is my Julie E. Uh, so this is going to be a part A. So make sure that you come and, uh, and join in. Um, did everybody write in here if you have a channel? I don't know. My, I, I mean, I, I, I'm having some serious brain farts. I don't, I don't know why I'm, I, I'm just going totally blank, but that's okay. That's all right. So, uh, Skinner Farms, Josh is in the house. Hey, Josh, we got Acrylic Creations by Jay Whitty. Hey, J Janet. Oh God, it's going fast. Auntie Gail, love you. Um, Paul Wright Lawns. Hey, Paul, what's going on? Uh, my sweet Janice, my sweet Janice. Glorious Gallery, hi! Oh, yay! That's my girl. We got Deidre Miller, D's art. Hi, D, my love. Captain Batten's in the house. What's going on, Captain? And I missed that one. Damn it. Um, and I missed that one. Stuntman Steve's in the house. Yay! Hey, Stunt. Ah! Um, then we got Joyce Snodgrass. Hi, Joyce. Yay! I love to see your name pop up. That's great. Um, we got Sherry in the house. Hi, Sherry. Um, Ah, now it's going away again. See, this is what happens to the chat. Okay, it's coming back up again. Nope, nope, I already said that one. Um, okay, well, we'll just, you know, I, I, um, if I missed your name, I apologize. There's Crazy Ann. Hey, beautiful. What's going on? Um, <laughs> Silent Steve wave. Yay! Kitty303, hello, how are you? Oh my God. Hi, Rudy. It is 7.09 p.m. in Houston, Texas. Thank you, Rudy. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, Captain Batten, sweet dreams to you, my friend. I'm glad you popped in to say hi. Thank you. He's in Belfast. So get some good rest, my friend. Oh, that was a big one, and it just went, whoosh, and I have no idea. Um, oh, Donna, I just want to let you all know I felt your energy and love that you all sent over the last couple days. It has helped me get through. Thank you all from the bottom of my heart, and I love you all. And we love you, Donna, and if I can make you smile and laugh, just for this little bit of time, then my job here is done, baby. So, still sending you all that love. Okay, and we got, and it is for, <laughs> it is 420 in Cleveland, Ohio. Woo! -hoo! Thank you, Joey Edibles. Square Table Degenerates is here with us. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, Julia Lee's in the house. Hello, Julia, my love, my love, my sweet. Paul Wright Lawns, got a channel. He's got beautiful horses, and he shows them on the channel. If you like horses, you would really love that. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. Um, okay, Tam's Art. Yes, I saw your name earlier, and I was like, who else? Who else? Who else? Tamara, namaste, my love. How are you? I still need 
I still need to email you. I know. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm really trying to keep it all together. You know what I mean? Coming unglued. But that's okay. That's all right. You know, we got 27 people, beautiful people watching this right now. Um, that's a mosh pit. In my opinion, I think that would be a mosh pit. So Julie is in the house. I love you, darling. How are you? Hey, um, I gave information about your collaboration tomorrow night with Nate Bright. That was cool. Did you hear all those rhymes? That was great. Okay. Um, and it starts at 8 p.m. Eastern time. And Julie, Nate is at 8 and Julie's at 8.30 p.m. Eastern time. And it's a collaboration, and it's the primary uh, color focus is going to be magenta. And Julie, e, if you could tell us just a little bit more about that, I would appreciate because um, my memory's not all that great. I was trying to memorize it, but I was buffering. And, you know, when you're working on your phone, I mean, what can you do? You know what I'm saying? Okay, I think my brain farts are all out now. I'm feeling a little more at ease, so we're we're golden. We're we're good. Okay, so let's um talk about what we're gonna do tonight. Um, um, yeah, I don't think there was any more announcements that I needed to make. So anyway, we're working on a ten by twenty, a ten by twenty inch gallery wrapped deep edged canvas. This is one that I had painted on before and I did not like it. So I painted it with titanium white today and it's dry now and we're gonna paint over it. Because I'm running out of them and well, that's just what you do when you're an artist. You, you all know that. I, I'm not telling you anything you don't know. Um, okay, so I've got 10 colors. <laughs> And this is, gonna, this is gonna be fun because I was gonna do one big cup. I'm, I'm gonna, okay, I'm gonna do, okay, let me start over. Um, this was inspired by Mina Villegas Art. We all know and love her. She is my good friend and my mentor. Um, her last um, video that she did was a huge canvas. It was a like a 30 by 40, I think. Man, she's the queen of the big canvases. And um, she did, it was a flip cup, but she moved it around, lifting it slightly, um, which causes the vacuum and the paint came out slowly. And it was almost like a wandering flip cup. Um, I don't know if that's what it's called. But that's what I'm calling it. Um, but it is inspired by Mina Villegas. And if you didn't see that, Poor. Oh my God, the colors were gorgeous and the design that it made came out beautiful. Um, so yeah, so that's, that's what I'm going to try and do. Um, I, I'm, I'm wafting between using a seven ounce cup. I'm going to use a seven ounce cup. I was going to use, I was going to use three, three ounces which I know that's small, but you can still, I can still get a good many layers in this or do a dirty pour. Um, and then do three different areas of the 10 by 20, like going down the canvas. I don't think I'm gonna do that. That it kind of goes against the whole wandering thing. You know, I mean, if there's three on there, you're only gonna wander a little bit. So yeah, so we're gonna do a seven ounce cup we're gonna layer it with all these colors, nice thin layers so it has a lot of contrast. And then we're gonna flip it onto the canvas and we're gonna we're gonna make it travel down. So we'll see if it works. It worked for Mina, but she is she is the queen. Oh yes, queen. Yes, queen. All right, so um yeah. <laughs> so we'll see if it works. I don't know. Okay, um, so let me uh, go over the colors uh, that we have here, that we have, Chia. All right, this is uh, Artist Loft um, Metallic Cobalt Blue. And if you're just starting out, or even if you're not just starting out, if you've never used this color, 
You need this in your arsenal. <laughs> you thought I was going to say in your arse. <laughs> that would have been funny. But no, you need this in your arsenal. Because it's a beautiful color. And it's cheap. That's the best part. Hi, Joanne. What's going on? Okay, now we've got... Uh, this is a combination of PBO Studios Violet, Artist Loft Violet, and Artist Loft Metallic Purple. Yeah, so it's kind of a hodgepodge, but that's all right. It made a really pretty color. I love you, Dee. I love you so much. I really do. I love all you guys. You have no idea. This is what I live for. This this breathes life into me. So, and all of you being here, it means the world to me. Okay, so now, and yes, I am putting the paint right up in your face, Nathan. Ah! <laughs> okay, so this is folk art. Um, it's the, their color flash, it's aqua flash, and it's gorgeous. Oh my God, oh my God, I love that color. And then we got um, 24 karat gold by Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics. Beautiful. Um, all the paints are mixed with um, Julie E's School Glue, 70%, water 30%. That's it. And paint. And it's it's beautiful. It works so nicely. And this is Artist Loft uh, Soft Body. Yeah, soft Body in white. <laughs> I don't know what I'm sitting there sticking my duck lips out for. <laughs> there was nothing else. Okay, and now we got Artist Loft uh, Cadmium Yellow. Love that color too. Mm. Especially up against purple. Whoo! You talk about a party for the eyes. Oh my God. All right, this is Artist Loft Neon Violet, which is <gasps> divine. God, I love that color. Mm. Um, <laughs> I'm starting to get brain farts again. This is Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics in deep sapphire. Love that color. My God, are we almost done yet? Okay. <laughs> and now I'm shaking. <laughs> this is... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny. Okay, Artist Loft in copper. We got copper going on here. Copper Obsession, baby. Look at that. Mm. And then, um, last but not least, like, you need to see this. It's black. It's, it's our soft, soft body black. And uh, we're going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to put you down to the canvas. I don't have any music. I'm sorry. We can still shake it. Make sure you have your beverage of choice. If you smoke it, got it. No, that's not what I meant. I meant if, if you got them, smoke them, whatever. Uh, drink what you want. Lemonade, lemonade, that cool, refreshing drink. Yeah, or you can drink wine or you can drink whatever, you know, whatever you want. Um, and then, uh, yeah, we're gonna get started and we're gonna see if I can do this. I don't know. I'm scared, scared. All right, here we go. I'm scared about taking you guys down to the canvas because this thing's probably gonna fall apart. <laughs> Knowing my luck. <laughs> Okay. All right. We're, this is gonna. This is gonna be okay. All right. I'll, I'll be right back. I'm drinking creaming soda. You mean cream soda? <laughs> Sorry. I love cream soda too. It's delicious. Yes. Okay. Nobody really cares about that. So let's just let's just do this. God, it is so quiet without the music. Ah, it's killing me. It is absolutely killing me. Rudy, is it killing you? 
I bet it is. All right. Oh, my Lord. So how was everybody's Monday? I keep forgetting it's Monday. Oh, and it's Labor Day, too, here in the States. Um, I don't know if it is all over or not, but... So it's actually a holiday. So how how was everybody's Labor Day? I hope good. All right, here's our. Okay, it's 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 eight ounces, but you know who's counting. So we're gonna put in a little bit of gold in the bottom. You don't want to put too much. You don't want to put a whole great big dollop because it will take over oh <laughs> sorry the lights really low <laughs> oh my god then we got white i always put white after gold because it locks it in if I have I have not locked it in in the past and it just puts like a gold sheen over the entire painting which is very pretty but if that's not what you were you know going for you know then that's a problem so uh, I'm not gonna do it with the stick it's gonna take too long All right, so we got cadmium yellow. Neon purple. No, neon violet. Yeah, neon violet. <sighs> oh, my hand's in the way. You can't see. Oh, sorry, guys. And some copper obsession, baby. Metallic cobalt blue. Oh, what's next? What's next? Oh, was it? A little bit of black, not a whole lot. Um, then the aqua flash, nice, generous amount of that because I love it. Then we're gonna go with the violet. I think I hit every color. No, no, I did not. Crap. Um, all right. A little bit more copper, a little bit more than that. Then the deep sapphire which I just poured some on the canvas. That's all right. Okay, um, then we're just gonna start over with thinner layers. And I'm sorry, I can't see the chat right now because I've, I've got the phone, the camera down on the canvas, so. I do have it up on the big screen, so if if there's a question or whatever, just um, put it, if you can put it in all caps and, and asterisks, if you need to get my attention, I'll be able to see it on my TV if you do that. Um, all 
I'm hoping all these colors like play well together. They're so beautiful. But you know, sometimes colors don't like to play well together. But I always like to push the envelope, so. I make them get along. <laughs> I'm the peacemaker of colors. <laughs> uh, so I hope everybody had a nice Labor Day. Okay, we're almost done here. When you make thinner layers, this really um, can take a bit of time. And I don't have music, so I know it's kind of boring. I apologize. And I'm gonna skip the copper and just, we're just gonna end with the deep sapphire. All right. That looks pretty good. That looks pretty good, pretty good. All right, everybody's saying hello in the chat. Is that Nate Bright in the house? I don't have my specs on. Let me just go look at the TV. Nate Bright, oh my God, what are you doing? All right. Whoo! Yeah, Donna, I, I fill it to the brim, man. I, I like to live dangerously. Yeah, when you flip a cup that's all the way to the brim, you're, you're flying without a net, you know what I mean? <laughs> but that's okay. Um, yeah. Yay, hi Nate. I was telling everybody about you and Julie E's collaboration and I'm really excited about it. So everybody check them out. All right, I'm putting off the inevitable, so. Let's just go ahead and do this. That This is a beautiful cup. Um, I'm not sure if you guys can, can see that uh, well, but let, beautiful cup right there. Delicious, I'd drink it, I would. Did I tell you that the pouring medium is 70% Elmer's school glue and 30% water? I think I did, okay. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and give this a flip and then I'm gonna try and bring it down the canvas by lifting it slightly like Mina did in her last video. <laughs> That's the plan. Here we go. Oh, I am loving that. I am loving that. Look at that. Oh my God. Okay, all right, settle down. Simmer down now, simmer down. Okay, whew, I'm getting all excited. Oh, look at these cells and lacing. Oh my God. Okay, all right. So you wanna, you wanna tap at the bottom of the cup so you can get all the paint to come down. And then I'm going to uh, gently, uh, Oh my God. Boy, it's really stuck on there. <laughs> All right, we're just, we're just gonna start moving it and see what happens. Whoa, oh my God. I didn't wanna pull it that hard. Oh no. Is there more? Oh, there is more. Whoa, oh my God. Hey, I'm digging that. Woo! Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I am liking that. Okay, so, um, yeah, I'm digging this. Check out the inside of that cup. Crazy. Yeah, that is crazy. I love the inside of the cup. Fun. Fun on a bun. Okay, well, we need to get rid of the cup. And I need to move these other ones down. I need to torch this, because there's a bunch of bubbles. So I gotta move the paint down just a touch. There we go. 
There we go. Better. All right. So we're going to move our paints out of the way. Because we're going to have to tilt this. And I'm not sure what color. I don't even know if I'm going to need a flow extender, but I probably am. Um, God, I don't know. All right, we're just going to use white as a little bit of a flow extender. Right. No, I didn't. Okay. All right. That's good. Good enough. Good enough. Good enough. All right. So now we're going to um, give it a torch. Whoo! Thank you, Steve. Thank you very much. I'm digging it. I, I really am digging it. Nice. Look at, I'm getting those little confetti things too, Julie. Look at this. And they're white with the cadmium yellow coming up in the middle of them, but they're teeny tiny. That is crazy. You just had that on yours. I like it. It's cute. It's really cute. So, all right. Oh, this is the part that scares me. <laughs> Everything scares me. I'm a scared little bird. <laughs> ah, this is fun. I hope you guys are having fun. I'm just having a blast. Man, I'm digging these colors. And I'm tilting really slow because I don't want to mess with the composition, you know, of all this in here. So I have to do it really slow. Like, I'm just going to bring this over. Because it's not moving and I don't. I'm, I'm afraid I'm going to tilt everything off trying to get that over to the side. So it's okay to pull your flow extender over to the edge. It's actually better than okay. It's probably the right thing to do. <laughs> I'll just erase those blue lines there. And there. All right. Where was I? <laughs> see, now that I moved that out, this is, you can see this is starting to move faster. But you have to keep an eye down here because you don't want to lose any of what you like down there too. So, I mean, there's definitely going to be negative space. I'd like to keep that. So... 
We'll see. We'll see. It could turn out totally, totally different than what we see right here, right now. That's that's the fascinating thing about fluid art to me. You think it's going to turn out a certain way. I guess it's kind of like life. Think it's going to turn out a certain way and it doesn't. But what it does come out as is 10 times better. So. All right. Here we go. All right, so I've got all the sides uh, covered and, oops, all the corners are covered. So we are good. Now I just need to torch it again and just take a look at it from a different angle and just see what we're dealing with here. Because I'm not sure, I'm not sure. I'm digging the colors, I'm just, uh, I don't know. I don't. I love everything that's going on in the middle of the colors. I love the flow of the colors. Um. And I love the composition in here. I just don't know about the shape of it. Um. I could get my my palette knife out and just do some, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know if I should continue tilting it. I mean, I really like it. I don't want the colors to, I don't know, I'm phoning a friend. Type in the chat what you think I should do. Uh, embellish the outside of it so it doesn't look as choppy or keep tilting. I always phone a friend. <laughs> freeze it. Shark, what do you mean freeze it? <laughs> By the way, hi shark. Shark! Stretch that baby out. Okay. Yeah. There's probably still too much paint on it too. So you're, you're, I believe, I believe Julie E was my phone a friend and I thank you. I thank you, my friend. Yeah, there's a lot of paint still. Which means it would, there's a whole lot of purple here. That's why I'm gonna try and take it off this way. If you leave too much paint on your canvas, it will crack and craze, and that's not a good look at all. And then you take the weight of the paint back to the center. Oh, Julie, I'm so glad I listened to you. This is looking incredible. I kind of I kind of like that. That looks like a wave. I'm going to keep it that way. I don't know. We'll see. I'll have to let me tilt it back down this way. It may not look right. It probably is not going to look right when I stretch it back down. So I'm just going to take it. Yeah. 
There we go. Weight of the paint back to the center. That's important that you do that because if you just start tilting without bringing the paint back to center, um, it gets wonky. Your cells will get, um, they'll break, uh, the sides will break and they'll break open and it'll just be a mess. Trust me, I've done it many a time, many a time. I love that. Uh, I can't see it. Ah. Uh, the corners themselves love the wave area too. Yep. All right. <laughs> Shark burp on it. I don't think that uh, that's not in the artist's repertoire or <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Oh my God, if tilting doesn't work, burp on it, right? That is true though, that's a good segue, uh, Shark. Thank you so much. September 17th, I am going to be holding round three, well actually Chadio is gonna be holding round three of our belching contest. I beat him in round two. And I assure you, I'm going to beat him again in round three. <laughs> so make sure you come out to Chattio's channel, and it's spelled just like it sounds. And uh, on September 17th, I think it's going to be at 2 p.m. Eastern Time. That's it. That's it. Oh my God. And then just slowly back down. Because I really don't want to have one white corner. I I'm digging this, man. These colors are the bomb. Especially with the black. It is way too quiet. Digging it, digging it, digging it, digging it. I like it a lot. Whew! I think I'm going to call this baby done. We do need to uh, torch it um, just one more time. I think this is the only corner that is bare. Make sure you check all your corners and your sides, especially if you're using the deep edge canvas. It's, it's such happy colors. I'm loving it. I really do. That's great. Okay. I got paint all over me. So we're gonna torch it, and then I'm gonna take the phone back and read the chat, and we'll chat and talk, and then we'll go. How's that? Oh, God, my hands are all sticky. Okay. <laughs> Mm 
getting a lot of those little confetti um, cells, Julie. I mean, they're beautiful. Like here in the, um, this looks like it's the aqua flash and the black. Yeah, that's what it is because they were next to each other. Underneath of that, it's popping up with the purples and the copper. It's really crazy. This looks like a starfish. I'm digging this. Look at these over here. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about with them boulder cells. I am thrilled. Thrilled to death. I'm very happy if you could not tell already. So, okay, the light's on high. All right, so I'm going to um, try and get you out of the cradle here without making everybody sick. Ow, oh, there we go. Hi. I'm back, and my hair is a mess. <laughs> I just noticed that. Oh, wow. It's the glasses. Oh, I am going to have to put them on if I'm going to want to read. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Thank you. Thank you, Janet. Thanks, Paul. I'm going to um try and take you down for a close-up, but if it's all shaky, I'll bring you back up. I promise. Look, there's Janice's pumpkins. Janice's pumpkins! Woo! Okay, here we go. I mean, I love everything about this thing. The colors, the movement. I mean, it's just, it's far out. Look, look at these guys down here. In these cadmium yellow cells. Crazy, crazy. Yeah, no, I do that all the time. So, um, yeah, so that's it. That's, that's it. I'm, thank you, thank you. <sighs> thank you, Nathan. And I know how you're saying that. I know how you're saying stunning. You're saying stunning, right? <laughs> I love your enthusiasm. Oh my gosh, you're you're just you're you're so funny. Okay, so um I'm thrilled. I'm I'm really digging this a lot. It's it's one of my favorites, I think, that I've done. Which that's saying something. Because I'm a terrible critic of myself. Thank you so much, Mary. Thank you. <laughs> Nathan. <laughs> Bingo. <laughs> Thank you, Joanne. Thank you so much. Um, yay. So, and you can fit 10 colors into a an eight ounce cup as long as you do it like nice and thin. And you see what happens when you use all those pretty colors. I mean, they just, they just dance together. It's amazing. Yeah, so, um, all right, so we're at like almost 50 minutes. We made good time. That's that's all right. Got a little bit of time to chat and then go. Um, yay. We're all our worst critics. Aw. Kitty, you do beautiful work. Everybody's got to go to Kitty 303. She is really, really talented. No, you haven't, Nate? You should try it. It's fun. It's fun. Thank you, Steve. Thank you. Yeah, I think the, mo the most colors I've used, the most number of paints I've used in a pour was 14. Yeah. All right, Julie E. I want to smell that chicken wafting over from Arizona, baby. All right, everybody, don't forget, Julie E., Nate Bright, tomorrow night, collaboration, magenta. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. And, um... Starts at 8 with Nate. <laughs> I love that. I'm a poet. And uh, and then 8.30, our beautiful Julie E. So be there. Be there, be square. So, yes. I hope everybody put in that they had a channel that had a channel. It's about collaboration, not competition. And I like to spread the love. So... Yay, D! I'm so glad you had uh, had fun. I'll, I'll be calling you tomorrow. I promise. I will message you first. I promise. 
Um, thank you all for being here. I really appreciate it. 26 beautiful people watching. I mean, I, I'm a lucky girl. I really am. And I appreciate each and every one of you. 27, just gained another one. All right. Thank you. All right, have a good night, everybody. Love and light to you and yours. And remember, keep pouring until you're soaring, baby, in art and in life. Thank you, Nathan. I'll see you guys later. Thank you, guys. Thank you. You're my tribe. I love you all. See you next time.